We blame our hormones for a lot of things, like mood swings, insomnia, and random food cravings, to name a few. But here's a wake-up call. What you're putting in your body has a direct effect on how your hormones operate. So technically, it's your responsibility to make sure they're happy and in balance. Hi, viewers, and welcome back to Bestie. Hormones play a huge role in health. Estrogen, for instance, affects everything from your reproductive system to your muscles. The hormone leptin controls appetite and satiety. Their imbalances can lead to a plethora of issues in the body, from inflammatory skin conditions like acne, eczema, to joint pain, fatigue, high blood pressure, headaches, and bloating. Unfortunately, they can also increase the risk for more serious diseases, such as cancer and diabetes. The good news is that by eating the correct foods, you can balance the hormone levels. And in today's video, we'll tell you the best foods for it from apples, salmon, avocado, green tea, to raw carrots and more. Watch till the end to learn about all of them. Number one, coconut oil. Coconuts are superfoods for a reason. It contains lauric acid, which is healing to the skin and also hugely beneficial to hormone production. Coconut oil is an extremely beneficial dietary fat thanks to its special medium chain fatty acids. While many foods have a negative effect on the thyroid, these compounds are small enough to enter the mitochondria, which are your cells' energy-burning powerhouses, where they're converted to energy. Studies have shown that coconut oil may increase energy expenditure, which may result in faster weight loss. It can also help with weight control when eaten daily as part of a balanced diet and with the removal of processed foods. Have you ever tried cooking with coconut oil? Tell us quickly down below in the comment section. Number two, apples. Apples are rich in quercetin, an antioxidant that reduces inflammation. Research shows that apples fight high blood pressure, reduce risk of cancer, fight viral infections, and much more. They are also the perfect fruit for weight loss since they're nutrient-dense, low in calories, and rich in fiber. Number 3. Broccoli there's a reason you were always told to eat your broccoli. On top of its multitude of health benefits, this cruciferous vegetable can help maintain estrogen balance. And since it's so high in calcium, it can also help with PMS. A study found that calcium supplements can ease premenstrual syndrome symptoms. Broccoli contains compounds which promote beneficial estrogen metabolism, which helps balance hormone levels in your body. It's also been found to be effective in reducing hormone-driven cancers like breast cancer. Number four, salmon. A 3.5-ounce serving of fish like salmon, mackerel, herring, lake trout, sardines, or albacore tuna can not only keep your heart healthy, it can help those at risk for heart disease. Fish provides good fats for cell-to-cell -cell communication, which leads to overall improved hormonal communication. This improves your mood and cognition as well. It's also been the focus of several studies on polycystic ovary syndrome, or PCOS, which can cause hormonal imbalances. A study found that omega-3 supplementation helped hormone balance and regulated the menstrual cycles of women with PCOS. Number five, seaweed. Those who suspect poor thyroid function as a cause of unexplained weight gain may plan a trip to the nearest sushi bar. The seaweed that wraps tasty rice and fish rolls contains a ton of iodine, a mineral that stimulates thyroid function. Practitioners of Asian medicine often recommend seaweed for those looking to shed pounds. Have I caught your interest? Well then hit that subscribe button to watch more videos. Join our millions of followers for more amazing bestie content. Number six, seed cycling. Seed cycling is an alternative medicine to help regulate your hormones. It's the process of eating four different kinds of seeds. These are pumpkin, flax, sesame, and sunflower seeds. It's done in two phases. In the first phase, take one tablespoon of pumpkin and flax seeds each in the first 15 days of the cycle. In the second phase, whole and raw sesame seeds and sunflower seeds are to be eaten one teaspoon each. These seeds are high in zinc and selenium and they support the thyroid gland. You can add these seed powders to your daily meal to do the trick. Number seven, avoid milk. Milk and its derivatives are considered to be one of the richest sources of essential nutrients. Many categorize dairy products as superfoods that can help you stay fit. However, they can disrupt your hormonal balance. Milk can lead to inflammation in the gut and mess with the hormones. Drinking it in excess raises the triglyceride levels and can contribute to the development of diabetes. So it's better to steer clear of dairy products if you're struggling with hormonal issues. Number eight, avocado. Avocados are loaded with compounds, which can positively affect blood cholesterol levels and help balance cortisol. The plant steroids in avocados also influence the two hormones responsible for regulating ovulation and menstrual cycles. A study found that the combination of fat and fiber in avocados increased hormones that promote satiety, and half an avocado for breakfast or lunch can help you stay full for hours. Number nine, avoid sugar and refined carbs. 
Sugar and refined carbs have been linked to a number of health problems. Indeed, avoiding or minimizing these foods may be instrumental in optimizing hormone function and avoiding obesity, diabetes, and other diseases. Studies have consistently shown that fructose can increase insulin levels and promote insulin resistance, especially in overweight and obese people with prediabetes or diabetes. Importantly, it makes up at least half of most types of sugar. This includes natural forms like honey and maple syrup, in addition to high fructose corn syrup and refined table sugar. In addition, diets high in refined carbs like white bread and pretzels may promote insulin resistance in a large portion of adults and adolescents. In contrast, following a low or moderate carb diet based on whole foods may reduce insulin levels in overweight and obese people with prediabetes and other insulin resistant conditions like PCOS. Number 10, green tea. Green tea is one of the healthiest beverages around. In addition to metabolism-boosting caffeine, it contains an antioxidant which has been credited with several health benefits. Research suggests that drinking green tea may increase insulin sensitivity and lower insulin levels in both healthy people and those with insulin-resistant conditions like obesity and diabetes. Since green tea has other health benefits and most studies suggest that it may provide some improvement in insulin response, you may want to consider drinking one to three cups per day. Number 11, leafy greens. Greens like spinach, kale, collard greens, and Swiss chard are loaded with antioxidants and can help prevent inflammation. Leafy greens can also reduce stress, thereby lowering cortisol levels and helping balance estrogen. Additionally, greens are high in fiber. Fiber aids in lowering estrogen levels, which may reduce risks for hormone-related health conditions. In general, try to eat 25 to 35 grams of fiber daily to support hormonal balance. Number 12, quinoa. Quinoa is a gluten-free carbohydrate as well as a whole protein. While it is actually a seed and not a grain, it cooks and is eaten in a way that resembles whole grains. It helps balance hormones by keeping female testosterone levels even. Quinoa yields its power due to its high levels of protein that enable blood sugar stabilization. It also packs phosphorus and magnesium, which can alleviate PMS symptoms and promote sleep. Number 13, eggs. Eggs are one of the best foods for balancing hormones as they have positive impact on insulin and ghrelin hormones in the body. Specifically, insulin controls blood sugar while ghrelin controls appetite. Your insulin and ghrelin levels are lower after you eat eggs for breakfast compared to a carb-based meal. Similar to other proteins, eggs keep you full for longer, so you can end up eating fewer calories. This aspect is particularly advantageous if you have trouble losing weight. There are a number of ways to add eggs to your daily diet rather than just eating them boiled. Learn more about the best ways to cook them by watching Six Healthy Ways for You to Cook Eggs. Now back to the best foods to balance your hormone levels. Number 14, raw carrots. Estrogen dominance is an underlying cause of PMS, hormonal acne, fertility issues, man boobs, and erectile dysfunction, to name a few. Carrots actually contain unique indigestible fibers to help detox excess estrogen from the body. Raw carrots have been found to help by preventing the reabsorption of estrogen from the intestine, meaning the liver can more effectively regulate metabolism. Carrot protects the bowel and can improve the hormonal environment. It can also have a huge impact on hormones and immunity. Number 15, eat your water. Drinking too much water can deplete electrolytes and cause dehydration. So you don't really need to go overboard with the eight glasses of water. Instead, practice metabolic hydration, which optimizes cellular hydration. This is important for many people trying to balance hormones because it supports thyroid and adrenal glands. Juicing nutrient-rich organic fresh fruits and vegetables is important for optimizing cellular hydration. Metabolic hydration supports the thyroid and adrenal glands, helping to balance hormones naturally. Number 16, soy. Most of us know that soy affects estrogen levels, but eating the bean can have some positive benefits, especially during menopause. Edamame and tofu in small amounts have estrogen-like effects on menopausal women. This can help diminish symptoms like hot flashes. Soy may also be able to reduce the risk of breast cancer in some people. It was once believed that soy could increase breast cancer risk because it can mimic estrogen in the body, but it actually has been found that those who have a lifelong diet rich in soy may reduce the risk of breast cancer. Hormonal imbalance is something that should be recognized and tackled immediately. Learn how to identify these signs by watching 9 Symptoms of a Hormonal Imbalance in Women or 11 Symptoms of a Hormonal Imbalance in Men. So go ahead and watch one or both of these videos for maximum benefits. Have your hormone levels ever been out of whack? Let us know in the comment section below.